A trinity of faiths blending friendship between Christians, Jews, and Muslims today at a church picnic here in Omaha. And as Chase Moffat explains, the three men leading their respective followers, it's a story as old as creation. A Christian, Muslim, and Jew. Okay, so let's get these jokes over and done with right away. Hey, we have a lot of fun together, believe me. <laughs> we yes, joke around a lot, so yes, on one hand, we are a walking joke. <laughs> At this moment, we're sitting. So, yeah. <laughs> That's right. In fact, it's the vision of these three men to bring together three faiths, which history has said otherwise hasn't gotten along so well together so far. We live in particularly dangerous times where we've democratized the instruments of mass destruction and get more, ever more artful about the ways of killing each other every day. And we believe firmly that, that killing each other is not in God's will, uh, that we are meant to live in peace and that we worship the same God. That brings us to Countryside Community Church off 87th and Pacific Street this Sunday afternoon. The hall is jam-packed with people lined up for an equally massive amount of food. Sitting at the tables, Christians, Jews and Muslims just talking. Joy, overwhelmed with joy yeah. to see people having such a, a wonderful time and then going into conversations. I would love to be like a fly to listen to every conversation around every table. And while the Tri-Faith Initiative continues with today's picnic, here near 132nd and Pacific, the temple is already built and open, but construction continues. Organizers say by 2019, the campus should be completed with three additional buildings, including a church and a mosque. Ayah in the Holy Book Quran said that God created you so you get to know each other. And so these three men representing three faiths, three groups of followers, but with one belief. Together, we are all God's, Allah's, and Yahweh's children, and loved by Him. In Omaha with photographer Dustin Dales, I'm Chase Moffitt, WWT 6 News. This is the first year Countryside Church hosted the event at their building, and they also recently voted to become the Christian partner of the Tri-Faith Initiative earlier this year.